<laughs> Jane and Zion are his best friend, you know. It's true. Well, you know, I promised you that there was somebody special I was told about. And I thought I should get him up to the stage. What do you think? Yeah. Yes, it's not you, honey. Oh, sorry, honey. You were the appetizer. He's the main course. <laughs> You weren't last night. Okay. okay, Mayor, walk this way. I know if you could walk this way, you wouldn't need talcum powder. <laughs> Do we have a chair for the mayor? Can we put that chair up here, please? Look at that. The women are doing all the work here. Oh, you're doing that for me? Thank you ever so much. I mean, that's all right. He's come prepared. And what's your name? Jacob. Jacob is Jacob is trying to be in the backstage area. He doesn't want to be seen. But I think we should give Jacob a nice round of applause. Thank you. Come on, Mayor. There you go. I got you, baby. There we go. All right. Um, that's okay if you go for plop. It's true what they say. The mayor's always falling for me. <laughs> oh. Wonderful. You feel pretty good to me, too. Oh, my, Mary. Okay. Anyway, but so it's mutual. Okay. Ooh. Is there a, is there a, is there a, oh, your, your glasses are steaming all up. Oh, my goodness. What a scandal for no, they're really steaming up. Mayor, is there a Mrs. Leo here tonight? What's that? Is there a, is there a Mrs. Leo here tonight? Oh, of course. Okay, honey. Where are you, Mrs. Leo? Mrs. Leo, I'm going to warm him up and you can and go in for the kill, okay? Thank you. I'm just, you know, I'm just the warm up act, okay? Okay, Mayor, you know, you look, I gotta tell you this, it's amazing. He looks just like Joe DiMaggio. <laughs> if you're standing across the street in have glaucoma, just like him. <laughs> but I hear he really can swing a bat, okay? <laughs> Jumping Joe, Leo. Oh, by the way, that, that means that you're a lion, right? Leo the lion, yes. That's right. Can you growl for me, Mayor? Growl for me.
Man. Yes. We got to give the crowd what they want. We're wowing them, you know that. Yes. Okay. Mayor, you're so good. Maybe we can go on the road with this act. What do you think? Yeah. Maybe you could do, can you do weekends in bar mitzvahs? No. Okay. It's the Mayor and Marilyn show. What do you think? <laughs> Coming to a theater near you. What the heck? They can always fax what you need to sign. Why not? Okay. All right, Mayor. Now, somebody told me that you are having a birthday in the next 12 months. <laughs> Was he really? Is that your PR guy? He keeps shouting. He's shouting all the time. Or does he have Tourette's syndrome? I mean, a little of both. Okay. Are you family? No. Oh, get the spotlight off him. I think he's on the witness protection program. He talks a lot for somebody who's trying to be unnoticed. Okay. Okay, good. Just doesn't want to admit it. Do you know that guy? No. See, he doesn't want to admit it. Okay. I don't, okay. I don't want to embarrass him. Okay. All right. I don't want to hear about this. This sounds like something kinky. All right. Anyway, that's my department. Leave me alone. Okay. Anyway, Mayor. So what would a, a wonderful production by Marilyn Monroe be with the fabulous Mayor of Glassboro without... A Marilyn Monroe happy birthday. Yeah. Are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah. Mrs. Leo says he's always ready, honey. Here we go. Pretend that it's... Oh. You know, while they're acting that way, Mayor, I'm going to take an opportunity, if you don't mind, because, you know, when I was alive, they didn't have all of this hocus pocus and kind of magic stuff that they have now. It's not Viagra, don't worry. Okay, it's blue diamonds are a girl's best friend. Okay. No, I, I, I want to do a selfie with you, okay? In my day, if somebody told you that they wanted to do a selfie with you, it was a whole different thing. <laughs> told you're so fabulous and also I got a call from the Inquirer and they're waiting for me to text them this photo. So. <laughs> you see that on Facebook and maybe at your local post office. I don't know. Okay, so everybody I want you to remember and pretend and close your eyes and think that it's 1962 in Madison Square Garden. Bill Wheeling and the mayor of Glassboro, New Jersey. For oh, this momentous event, I come out in a dress that's practically sewn to my body. Late as ever. I'm really out of breath because I was so late. And hence the reason why this song came out of date. But after that, history was made. I walked up to the mic. I looked at the very handsome mayor and said, Kennedy Schmenity. <laughs> and I said, Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you.
wait a while the two of you just get a room.